I am doing a mystery cache multi-stage and I've made it to the first stage which I've been to before so I remembered where it is it's on that green box and um but I forgot to get the clue that's in it so I uh had to come back and double check it and get the clue and then um solve it and then go to the final so that's what I'm doing now alright I think I've solved it and I'm going to the final coordinates and the clue was interesting it was like pictures of animals it was like dragon rabbit horse ox rabbit dragon or something like that that's not exactly what it was but I don't want to give it away but it was something like that. So you have to figure out what that means and how to convert that to numbers and then go to the coordinates. So I'm going now. I solved it correctly. I found the correct place and signed the logbook. Now, I don't know if I want to go find more. I want to go back home because it's kind of gray and cold. And all the ones around here I've already found. So. I have to go kind of a long ways before I find any, but we'll see what happens. I just got a comment on my overview of 2011 video, and the guy basically said that uh, he wants my life, which is, I don't know, it's kind of funny to me, because, um, well, also here's an interesting fact, the number of hours in one year. 8,765. It's like 8765. Kind of cool. Uh, but anyway, that video basically took 8,765 hours and compressed it into 14 minutes. So, I'm pretty sure just about anybody's life would have at least 14 minutes of interesting things happen in over 8,000 hours. So, I mean, half of those are probably spent sleeping, but, you know, that still leaves 4,000 hours for cool stuff to happen, and probably way more than 14 minutes of things. So, uh, that type of video kind of makes your life seem more interesting than it really is. Maybe, I don't know. Thoughts. Burritos. I'm not sure what it is. It's probably something to do with the geography of where I live, the climate, the weather, and everything else, but, um, the temperature, whatever. But, uh, for some reason, after it rains here, uh, the frogs come out and they are very loud, so I'm just gonna walk outside and you'll just be able to hear them. Ready? And it's still raining just a little bit. But yeah, they're uh, pretty loud. So, interesting. Anyway, oh, we'll see you tomorrow.